Well, how, how, how are your children doing? Are they all right? <laughs> How are they? My kids are good. Yeah, yeah. I mean, they can't, on paper, they're great. They're two little white girls in America. Right, right. Yeah. I mean, what? Yeah. Sometimes I look at it that way. I look yeah. at them, I'm like, you can't say anything. Yeah. You're, you're doing awesome. Right. Just boilerplate, great lives. I gave my daughter medicine the other day, and it was bubblegum flavored, so that she'll take it. Bubblegum flavored medicine? Yeah, you get me like Tylenol, it's bubblegum flavored. Oh, it's not she, methadone or anything. It's no, Tylenol. no, no, it's bubblegum oh. flavored. <laughs> I give her, she's got a fever, Tylenol, bubblegum flavor. And she goes, ew. I'm like, F you, ew. <laughs> you can't say ew. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I it's it's medicine. It's medicine, right, exactly. It's medicine. Most children don't have medicine. Right. Most children in the world, they yeah. get sick, they die on a rock with a bear eating them. <laughs> that's, right. that's how they handle right, it. Right, right. And, oh, he's got a sniffle, ring the bear bell and put him outside, whatever they do. <laughs> You're a little white girl in America. You wear clothes made by children your age professionally. <laughs> you don't get to say ew <laughs> about your bubble gum medicine. <laughs> I never heard of bubble gum medicine. Well. Oh, right. <laughs> you got the holidays coming up. Are you doing any any plans? Any no, you seem I, like a very I, holiday guy. I, look, and I just, yeah. I just want to say I'm not trying to say that if you're white you can't complain. Right. I'm just saying that if you're black you get to complain more. Right. Right. Because <laughs> you can't. There you go. No, don't, don't tell the band that. <laughs> yeah. 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 Because yeah. you can't. You get this right. You can't take people's like historical context away from them. And right. everybody wants this to. Like white people are always like, come on, it wasn't us. Like they want black people to forget everything. Like every year, white people add a hundred years to how long ago slavery was. Yeah. I've heard educated white people say slavery was four hundred years ago. <laughs> no, it very wasn't. Yeah. It was 140 years ago. That's two 70-year-old ladies living and dying back to back. <laughs> That's how recently <laughs> you could buy a guy. That's it. And it's not like slavery ended and then everything has been amazing. <laughs> like it just... Oh, I'm glad that's over. Oh, yeah, it just ended like a clean <laughs> where you don't have to wipe. Just boom. And then it's just been parades and presents yeah, ever yeah, since. Yeah, exactly. You got to... You gotta remember that if you meet a black person, they have gray hair, they remember a time they weren't allowed to use a certain toilet. So give them a little, you know, time to be cranky. And by the way, white people have our own thing that we, yeah. stuff that we went sure, through. Sure, sure. That, that hurt us that we have to cope with. Like when they took our slaves away. That was really <laughs> hard for us. And we're still, so it's pretty even. <laughs> so, it's, so it's even. Yeah. It's even. All right, be right back with Aaron Rawlson. Louis C.K.